The Moroccan occupation in Western Sahara persists in denying the Sahrawi people their basic rights, aiming to pressure them into abandoning their legitimate right to self-determination and independence. Sahrawi human rights activists are urging the international community to take swift actions to compel the Moroccan government to halt these violations, which run counter the principles established by the United Nations and international agreements. We note with great concern the continued Moroccan violations of all rights of freedoms, such as the right to assembly and organization, the right to peaceful demonstration, freedom of expression, freedom of movement, and the establishment of associations, some of which were closed by force. In recent statements, the Sahrawi Association of Victims of Serious Human Rights Violations has criticized the Moroccan occupation's ongoing restrictions on observer delegations and international media access to the region. The association recalls the continuation of the Moroccan state preventing its new office from registering and operating, in addition to closing the area and preventing delegations of observers and the international press from visiting it, and the continuation of arbitrary detention, torture, preparing reports, fabricating charges and sham trials. To address the oppression and injustice faced by the Sahrawis in the occupied territories, the Sahrawi Assembly has proposed creating an independent international mechanism in addition to the Minorso mission. This new body would be responsible for gathering facts and monitoring the human rights situation in the occupied cities. The ongoing violations by the occupation forces in Sahrawi cities emphasize the clear distinction between Western Sahara and Morocco as separate entities, regardless of Mahzen's regime's attempt to present them as a single historical entity.